Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Pillars of Eternity, where we have a problem. That problem yes. is called a arch. horde ahead. of monsters over here near the... What are your skill... Your, what is your stealth skill? Four, five, three, four, seven, and five. I think for this, we want you. I'm here. And I think we want I'll take a look. stealth mode. <laughs> See if we can draw off a more limited selection of the monsters that we saw last time. I may the, by increasing difficulty, I may have just made it take longer without actually. Being Okay, so what we want is to get close enough that the yellow You know what? For this, we actually might want uh, our main character because her yes. stealth isn't that great and she'll be better at drawing them. Okay. Actually, everybody, hmm. please go stealth. And what does the flame reveal? The flame reveals nothing. Seriously. Yeah, I have to get close enough to talk to that. Yep, run, run. Hopefully that didn't trigger everybody. We'll see that in a moment here, though. The cutest cat is following us. Here we go. Yep. There. There. Yep, you're still using ranged. Nope, let's just do that now. Do a bless. How bad? Moet Ixis on. Okay, you're about to do a. a Oh, no, no, no. You should have done this. Okay. Where's... There we go. What's this? Spreading plague. Hmm. Ah, uh, objects were the rock! Okay. Got a lot of people here. Yep, yeah, there we go. Horse troll, horse lurker, Adra beetle, Adra beetle, Adra beetle, a dragon. You are going to get marked. You're about to cast. Let me try. Okay. There we go. There we go.
What's this? Nature's Balm. Current action. Okay. Hmm. Okay. And Twin Stones. Yeah. Oh, you're stuck. Ah, that's worse than rock! Okay. Are you still stunned? You are no longer still stunned. You are no longer stunned. What is this? No, no, no. Uh, let's move that a little bit. There. Yes. Okay. What is this? Call to slumber? Let's not do that. Um, let's do that. Okay, and that, please. I Good, that was useful. Okay. Where is that one that does the iconic projection? There we go. There we go. Yeah. The bottom beyond sea. Hate seeing the little guy go. And he's down. Okay. Horse lurker primordial is injured. Your vase. Let's get that flame blight first, because it's the <laughs> The dragon seems to be down. Okay. There's an address. <laughs> you. You. Have a solution to the whole people dead being down thing. What? They're closing in on us. Okay. You. Where's those twin stones? No, that's too much. Yeah, okay. Need something? We got more people coming in. I can't. Okay. My blood burns. Steadle! That didn't work. Need to try something else. Okay, there's a force troll, force lurker, and an adrip. Okay, there went uh, Sagani's wolf. I mean, not wolf. Uh, fox. And she's got bonded grief because her animal went down. Because her friend went down. No, let's not do that just yet. Do that. Might not help too much. No. Just shoot, I think. I think at this point. Need something? Lurker next. Dead on. Troll Finish next. them! Troll should be the last. Is the least dangerous. Okay. We are going to do. There's an a dragon. We are going to do a quick save. Whew! That was a rather tough battle. And I think. Ready, Watcher. We are not going to actually. How may I help? Battle. What? Yeah, no. Hey.
Let's see how that does for your health. You do have a wrenched shoulder. Minus two might, minus 25% attack speed. It's not terrible. Yes. It's not great, but it's not terrible. But let's uh, send security over a little bit quietly. Got it. And see what kind of monsters still remain in the area. I think we drained a lot of them. And some of the big ones as well. There are more beetles. Let's see if there's more to the south here. There's an earth blight. Let's do a little bit of fast motion. That's probably a bad idea. Now that I think about it. Oops. What are you? A dragon. Looks like we drained most of their forces. Oh dear. That was a mistake. Okay, everybody please, let's go to help Sagani. Trolls and lurkers. Are you your flank? Yes. Am I the only one here starting to nod off? Break might be in order. What is this? Okay. Got to try something. Yeah, that didn't work very well, did it? Hmm. What was that? Okay. Yes. That's not very helpful. Yeah, uh, keep fighting this. We got knocked down. This thing is near death. Oh, it's now on our side. And you're about to go back to fighting us. Let us end this! And I think before we talk to that, it is time to do a rest. So, we are taking a rest. That was painful. We have used quite a few res resources. No, we don't want Vessel. 
think we want primordial, primordial, and primordial. Okay. Hmm. You're pretty tough, actually. A little bit tougher than uh, either. The Adra Arc looms in front of you, just as you saw it through Persok's eyes. Sagani turns, watching the trees for movement. As the arc spot shadow falls over you, the wooded shore fades into a different sea. You are standing in another forest. Blackened, bare trunks claw their way out of the soil and keep a solemn vigil over the young trees and tender shrubs. You move slowly through the woods and the ruins scattered throughout them. Stone pillars and broken arcs show the bones of some destroyed buildings. Between and amidst it all are elves and orlands, their faces painted and their bows drawn. I don't have enough lore and I don't have enough survival. Glad you don't recognize it. That's just you haven't been lurking around ruins where you don't belong. Her vase eyes you intently with a wagging finger of faint electric. Sounds like you're describing the desolate stretch in the mountain slopes north of Twin Elms. Site of an old battle from the War of Black Trees. I've seen the next I'll follow you. Okay, she counts the arrows in her quiver before adjusting the weight on her. I always get a strange feeling near the end of a hunt. Like an itch on the end of my nose. I feel like we're close. Are you disappointed? Not at all. After all this time, a part of me had already accepted that I'd never find him, that I'd be stuck wandering like this forever. I'll admit, I didn't believe you at first. Still didn't until now. What changed? I haven't spent this much time around anyone since the long hunts in Nasitak. But I've gotten to know you, seen how you deal with Kith. Whatever else you turn out to be when we find Theos, you're honest. I know you wouldn't lead me astray in this. What I mean is, thanks. No one's done this much for me in a very long time. Feels almost like I'm part of a village again. What will you do after this is over? Good question. She runs her hand over the smooth, chiseled surface of the arch. After five years, I'm not sure what the point of this is. Persok has moved on, and while I'm out here, everyone in Masuk is carrying on, on, on as normal. And that'll be the case whether I come back having found Persok or die out here. To be honest, I'm not sure what that means for me. She thumps the Adra wall with the heel of her hand, but I'm getting ahead of myself. First, we've got to find Persok. As well as your quarry, Exil. Should give me time to figure out what I'll say to him. What do you think you'll tell Persok? I guess that depends on who he is now. I'd like to think that traveling for five years entitles me to give him a solid earful about all of it. Well, but what really matters to someone in Persok's position? The village he left behind? The family he likely won't remember? I wish my fractured memories told me more about the people closest to me. Must be lonely not knowing a thing like that. I guess I've taken that much for granted. Anyway, here's to finding our men soon. Let's talk about something else. What about Intumak? A good hunter, but not much of a talker, that's fine by me. When we hunt in Nasatok, we always bring, four, bring our foxes with us. They help us track and flush game. They're fearless defenders against bears and snow leopards. Clever Intimok has always been my favorite. He wags his bushy tail. Okay, let's move on. Locate the forest from the latest vision. Okay, uh, down here, I'm going to hit quick save. Down here we have those blights. And, um... Certainly. Oh, we want everybody. Oh. And beetles. Two blights and a beetle. And two a dragons. And the third blight. This is a little bit more difficult than I had thought it was. There we go. That actually might be a little bit too early. Do that first. Hmm. Yes. Do that. You can only mark one. We'll mark one of the dragons. Uh, 
and yeah, we'll bring that into play. How bad? Ah. Ooh, that didn't hey, work. Need to try something else. What do you mean that didn't work? You drank a potion. Are you still doing? Yeah, you are. You're. I, I apparently somehow queued up an action. Interesting. I did not know. I do not know how I did that. Are you? Nope. Why are you? Gain a protective layer of wooden skin imbued with characters becoming faster, less vulnerable to disengagement attacks, and immune to the stuck affliction. Ooh. There we go. Attack that Earth Blight. You. Interdict. Interdiction, please. And you are charmed. I'll check words and frost. Oh, that's going to leave us. Why are you charmed? You are charmed. Scar. You're still not on our side. Okay. Let's take the earth flight ah, here first. Take it. Uh, 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 then the earth flight over here. No. Raise fallen allies. Why are you out there? <laughs> Greater Earth Flight. <laughs> Someone so check on Aloth! Aloth is down. Can't stand much more. Okay. Well then, let's see if that helps. See you in the next video.